Baker Mayfield was tackled as he released the ball on a throw midway into the third quarter. By video and the way his left arm was positioned, this is likely a re-aggravation of a labrum tear in his left non-throwing shoulder. Specifically, his arm is in an abducted and externally rotated position when he lands full weight on it. This is a position that was likely re-injured the left shoulder labrum tear that he sustained week two of this season. He's been wearing a harness on his left non-throwing shoulder after this injury that helps to keep the shoulder from going in a provocative injury position and helps to limit re-injury to the labrum and shoulder joint by keeping it stable. He will most likely need surgery on his left shoulder, but it likely can wait until the end of the season. However, there is a cost to re-injury to the shoulder joint, including getting more extensive labral tears, more injuries to the bones around the shoulder joint, which keeps it stable, and can also injure other structures around the shoulder. No question that he is tough being able to play through this game week six and actually come back into the game as well as recover very well after the injury he initially sustained to that left shoulder in week two. He didn't finish the game in week six, but that could have been a coaching decision on top of it re-aggravating his left shoulder labrum injury. We will continue to monitor the situation and await additional information from the Browns organization, including any additional MRI data that he will likely get after the game or the next couple of days. However, expect to see him on the field next week, barring any unforeseen exam or imaging findings. Baker, you're certainly showing some grit and good luck with the recovery.